conservative media viewers what's going on. It's me, John D. Villarreal again. We've got another science video here and it's based upon images from Mars. This was the uh, rover Opportunity and it basically went 13 miles over three years on between Victoria Crater and Endeavor Crater and this was really really intense type of stuff here. What you're seeing are shots that were taken towards the end of the day I believe of the horizon throughout this trek. What you see up at the top there are the numbers of the actual sort of photographs that are sort of put together here. I think there's something over 300 some odd photographs that are being put together here. It's incredible. I mean you imagine this. You look at the changes in the topography there, in the geography if you will, of that terrain over 13 miles. Think of what else is there on Mars. This is just absolutely incredible. We are now, just now starting, in my personal opinion, this is all my personal opinion by the way, I'm not alleging facts, not cast aspersions, all for entertainment purposes only. Please check disclaimers. In my personal opinion, we are just now starting to uh, seriously explore Mars in, in, a, in a meaningful way and I am very excited about what we might find there especially with this whole uh, uh, the effort going on on August 5th where you know the Mars rover Curiosity may be landing in Gale Crater I've done other videos on that and you can check that out but look at that look at that there and you can hear obviously the accelerometer, sort of how it reacts to the different terrain, whether it's a little rougher, whether it's a little softer with the sand. But I love those little rock formations there. Some of the coolest pictures are going to be coming up here soon that you can see in the horizon. And remember, this is only 13 miles. There is an entire planet, the red planet, set to explore. What about the polar caps? What about Gale Crater? What about finding, you know, water flow? What about what happens with the different seasons? What about digging under? Under the soil? Are there microbes there? Is there life on Mars? Is there alien life, even if it's very small, bacteria, microbes, different little organisms like that? What if there isn't life now, but there was before? We can find some clay fossilized stuff. I mean, look at this terrain right there. I mean, who knows what might be there? You've got Olympus Mons. You have so many different things going on in Mars, and it's the closest planet to us in the solar system. This, to me, is terribly exciting. It's excellent science. I love it. You tell me what you think. Give me the comments below. Please subscribe above. I'm John D. Valero and you're watching Conservative New Media.